Hey everybody, what's up? It's Taylor here with another Taylor's Take. This time it's on Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Honey. That's right, I am here at the Regal at LA Live where I just saw opening night of Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Honey. But not only did I come see it opening night, I came to the special screening that had the composer, the cinematographer, and the actor who plays Winnie the Pooh himself were all in attendance. There was a really fun Q&A after that lasted about a half hour, which I will also be uploading to my YouTube channel along with a one-on-one -on -one interview with Andrew Scott Bell, who is the composer of the film. That was such a fun interview. And he actually played a little bit of the honeycomb violin for me. I cannot wait for you guys to check that out. Anyways, you guys are here for my review on Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Honey. As you know, I have been over the moon excited for this because I cannot believe this is a real movie. I cannot believe that Winnie the Pooh is in public domain and that there's a horror slasher film with Pooh and Piglet. That is nuts to me. I had so much fun with this movie. I was smiling the whole time. I was laughing the whole time. I just thought the kills were really fun. The gore was really fun. I had a lot of fun with the animations up at the beginning of the film. <sighs> Such a good time. It's really cool because during the Q&A, someone asked about Tigger and they said, Tigger's not in public domain. And then they paused and then they said, yet. So as we know, there is already a Winnie the Pooh Blood and Honey 2 coming soon. And they are hinting that Tigger will be joining in on the festivities. I cannot wait to see that. I took, it took every fiber of my being to not pitch myself to be in Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Honey number two, because I, th that's like a dream role for me. Could you imagine me running around as Tigger? My hair is fucked up. But could you imagine how much fun that would be for me? Overall, I would say Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Honey is a huge recommendation for me. I would say take as many people as you can to see it, because this is something you have to see for yourself to believe it. I'm still in disbelief. Even though I've seen it, I cannot believe it's real. I cannot believe this exists, but how fun. And I can't wait to see number two. That's, that's my pitch for Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Honey number two. Just call it number two and uh, put me in there as Tigger.